printing. According to your test results, you're fit as a fiddle, Administrator. Why did you want a full body examination all of a sudden? It hasn't been that long since your last physical. Are you feeling unwell at all? Maybe you're exhausted. Did you overdo it on your holiday with Fur and the others a few days back? I heard you all went on a food and drink binge, and even went to that new amusement park afterwards. Ah! Even I'm a little envious! in with her. I finished everything exactly as instructed. <laughs> What's the commotion? Relax. No need for the formalities. Didn't we already meet last night? A lot's happened since I've been away from headquarters. You and Shu have done well in my absence. Thank you. Not yet. All we could confirm is that it was a road modifier. The rest remains unknown. Individuals this dangerous are more Kord's area of expertise, so I handed the case over to them. They'll keep us apprised of any developments. Still bothered about the attackers? Indeed. Perhaps there's a goddess of luck somewhere watching over us. Hmm? What do you mean, Administrator? shape after the teacup ride, Admin. Hmm? That's not what happened. You slunk off to a corner by yourself to recover. How could you forget that already, Admin? That was just a few days ago. Oh, it was too bad, really. We still had one more ride left. That's right. The soft opening for the roller coaster was super busy. We couldn't even get a spot in line in the end. Huh? Are you okay, Admin? Are you feeling sick, Administrator? to save her. This is simply a quiet place partitioned out from a virtual data fortress. I didn't want our meeting to be disturbed, and this is a solution I'm capable of executing. In a way, everything in existence, including thoughts, appears as signals to me in the fortress. I know you'd like to know my name and who I am, but I'm afraid that we'll all have to wait until we meet again in the real world. Still, it's been a long, long time since we've been able to have a good talk like this. To celebrate the occasion, I have a gift for you. Answer me this. Do you want to save her? I do. As I said, all things and all thoughts in this world, even time and space, are visible to me here. I cannot. 
Remember refers to recalling things you've experienced. Those images you're seeing never truly existed, nor do they belong to you. You simply happen to exist in them. That's why I can't help you remember them. That said, I can tell you a little about her. Like us, she was never meant to exist in this world. But she opened Pandora's box, drawing from the well of her own past, until she finally became a person with no past, only a future. Correct. And that future has everything to do with you. I hear there have been developments in your investigation in Zhu Hong. You could say that, but it's too soon to act. Someone out there has been burying things and covering their tracks flawlessly. So flawlessly that I know something's a mess. Like they say in Zhu Hong, the more you try to hide something, the more you expose it. I've already been searching for this long. I can spare the time to play along with them. There isn't much I can do to help. But you don't have to worry about things here at headquarters while you're gone. That's all I've asked for. If it weren't for you, I'd be drowning in endless administrative tasks and paperwork. You'll return to Zhu Hong in a few days, right? Will you be spending some time with the younger staff before you go? They haven't gotten to see much of you. <laughs> of course. It's only a few days, but I also want to see how everyone... <sighs> Are you okay? What is this feeling? A vision? No, that's not it. This data that never should have existed followed a beacon here to you before it dissipated. This is a highly unusual phenomenon. As for why you became the beacon, I suppose it's because its contents were filled with you. The gravitational force you exert overpowers even the rules of this world that normally govern the recycling of these impurities. But these things are like drifting spring dandelion seeds that happen to land at your feet. Even without your intervention, in just a few steps, They'll float away all on their own, without ever impacting you or this world. What? You can. But it won't be easy. Too many wish her dead. The one who made her. The one entrusted with the task. Her old friend who walks a different path. As well as those who don't want her existence to be discovered. If you want to save her, it means you'll be setting yourself against all of them. If you want to forge a way out admit that much desire to kill, even I would only have one chance to get it right. Uh, do you remember who she is? And yet... You still want to save her? Wonderful. You haven't changed at all from before. I'm actually a little jealous. That girl has already died. Her body was destroyed two days ago. Not in the future or in a dream. She was erased from this world in the true sense of the word. The passing of life. The flow of time. All are bound by the rules of this world. So-called visions are nothing more than a limited form of resistance. But we're different. We were once beings existing above this false world. If you wish it, I will do it for you. If you dislike it, I can change it for you. To that end, even reversing time is a minor undertaking. It's not a vision. 
time itself is actually being affected. The only one capable of something like this is... Odin, what did you see? It's you. It has to be you. I've been searching for so, so long. And finally... We've been apart for so many years. And now, you are in my reach. I finally... Found you! According to our latest report, escape test subject 0705 has yet to be retrieved. All squads comb the area. 0705 must be found tonight. Roger! Huh? What's with this rain all of a sudden? Odin, are you still going out in this downpour? Why don't I come with you? No need. You head back to headquarters. I can handle this myself. Logistics, take care during the reclamation. This is important experimental material. And remember to clean up the area when you're done. By dawn, it should look like nothing happened there at all. Huh. We made it in time. Once I noticed that 0705 was missing, I had everyone search the entire city for her. We're lucky we found her before the end. Speaking of which... Surely there was no need for such brutality. That wasn't my doing. Huh? What do you mean? The situation was already like this when I arrived. Ma'am, we've confirmed that these are the remains of artificial life form 0705. Except... Except what? Except her central chip is missing. Uh, but it wouldn't be strange if something that small didn't survive such intense damage. I see. Strange. You didn't do this, nor did any of my people. Could she have been attacked by 0704 or a wandering Bisbane? <sighs> How sad. 
sudden. That rain. As sudden as it was deliberate. To wash things off.